Hello viewers, welcome to Elimu TV, a station where you watch and learn. I am your tutor, Seron Maida. So today I'm going to take you to through CRE Form 1, Lesson 10. We are still under the topic creation and the fall of humankind. What our subtopic today is the attributes of God. Welcome. So we start with the lesson objectives. What is expected of the learner by this, by the end of this lesson? So by the end of the lesson, the learner should be able to mention the attributes of God from the biblical creation account. The learner should be able to mention the attributes of God from the biblical creation account. We look at the attributes of God from the biblical creation account. What are attributes? Attributes are qualities or characteristics that someone or something have. Those attributes, they are qualities or characteristics that someone or something has. So we have to look at, the, we want to look at the attributes of God from the creation accounts. This includes the first creation accounts and the second creation accounts. So, what is the sole creator and the only source of life? God is the sole creator and the only source of life. That's an attribute of God from the biblical creation story. God is immortal and eternal. God is seen as immortal and eternal, everlasting. God is self-existence. In the creation account, God is self-existence. He's always there. He's self-existence. Another attribute of God from the biblical creation account is that God is a God of order. He's a God of order. As seen in the first account of creation, God created everything in order from day one up to day six and he rested on the Sabbath day. So he's a God of order. Then another attribute of God is that God is a source of goodness and true happiness. God is seen as a source of goodness and true happiness. That's another attribute of God from the biblical account of creation. He's a source of goodness and true happiness. Another attribute is that God is holy, merciful, and just. He's holy, merciful, and just. Remember that like he's so manless, lonely, and he decided to make him, to give him a helper, and he made woman out of his he is merciful and just. God is seen as the provider and sustainer of the universe. He is the provider and sustainer of the universe. From the creation account, you can see he is the provider and also the sustainer of the universe. He created everything from the creation of the universe. Another attribute is that God is all knowing, that He is, he is omniscient. He is all knowing, He knows everything. That's why God is as he is omniscient. Another attribute of God is that he is omnipotent. He is all powerful. He is all powerful. He is omnipotent. Another attribute is that God is omnipresent. He is everywhere in the sea, in the sky, in man. He is omnipresent. That is, he is everywhere. He is a personal God. He is also a personal God. That's another attribute. Another attribute of God is he has a mind and a will. He has a mind and a will. He does his will. It was his will to create everything that he created because he has a mind and a will. And he is a moral God. He is a moral God. That is, he, he is interested in the behavior of man and woman. He commands him to do the right things. He's a moral God. He's interested in the behavior of man and woman. And you can see him commanding him to do the right things. They gave him even responsibility to name everything he created. So those are the attributes of God from the biblical accounts of creation. Remember this is from the two accounts of creation. So that's the end of the lesson. We have an activity. Except you've answered the following question correctly. 
write down the five attributes of God from the biblical creation accounts. Write down five attributes of God from the biblical creation accounts. On to our references, you can refer to the Secondary Christian Religious Education Student Book 1, KLB 3rd Edition. Thank you for joining us. For more, for this and more, you can contact us if you have a question or any opinion on our SMS number, which is on the screen. And you may find us on YouTube, Elimu TV, Facebook, Elimu TV, and on Twitter, Elimu TV underscore KE. Until next time, bye-bye.